Hello, my Virgo, my Virgo singles. <clears throat> We're going to see what's going on for you guys. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. This is for Virgo singles, all right? <clears throat> this is for those of you who are completely single. Um, you're not really thinking about anybody or trying to get, trying to actively get back with anybody. Doesn't mean that somebody is not trying to get back with you, okay? So we're going to see what's going on for you guys. <clears throat> we're going to do three cards for where you are, um, what you need, and what your intentions are, okay? If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and um, we will get this thing going. My Virgo Singles. This is for the 21st through the 27th. And um, here we go, Virgos. I feel like some of you are either in a relationship or you're thinking about it. Um, so I may have some people here that are watching that are um, actually in relationships, okay? Now, if you are truly single, this is you looking to get into a relationship. Like you are, um, you know, you've done the single thing for a while and now you feel like, okay, it's probably time for me to settle down, to lock somebody in, okay? Not in a bad way, but you know, just offer commitment to someone, okay? This Piscean energy. Let's see. What you need is if you have your sights on somebody, then you need to speak up. You need to go towards them, take action, okay? Because a closed mouth does not get fed, okay? I'm sure all of you have heard of that. So if there's somebody that you've got your eye on, you feel like this person is um, for you or you're attracted to them, you see good things in them, it's time to make a move towards that, all right? Your intention, I feel like, is not only to not be burdened in a relationship, to not let things get to you, but I feel like this is you dropping the burden of letting go of your single dumb okay i feel like for a long time some of you have been single and you kind of defended that position um you know you didn't want to have to answer to anybody tell anybody where you're going just really involve anybody in your personal affairs in your personal life here and i feel like a lot of you intend to um you know let go of that Okay, let go of that and speak your truth. Yeah. Now, for those of you who are um, truly, truly single, you're a very confident person. Very, very confident person. And you're just happy with your family with your friends and you know you just you just enjoying your life at this point all right you're just enjoying your life at this point and that's all the burden that you want to carry um you know is within your home within your family unit Okay, but there is a need if you are truly single to if there's something that is bothering you here to speak up in your family unit as well. All right, okay, but back to those of you who are looking for somebody, you are a prime catch, okay, because you're secure. You're confident, you have your coins up, and um, you're ready to come out of this, this cage. You're ready to come out of that. You're ready to explore other things here.
Look at that, falling under the Knight of Swords. It's time to go turn around and go towards what you want to make an offer. This is what you need to make an offer. There's also a need for you to not move too quickly, okay? To do things at a steady pace. Think about what it is that you really want. Go towards it, but, you know, go towards it in a way where, um, you know, you're not overwhelmed. Because I feel like with this Ten of Cups, there's somebody that you are really smitten over. Um, so, you know, take baby steps, but don't go too slow. That is a thing. Go at the right pace. All right? Yeah, see? We have death there in your intentions. Transforming those old thoughts of, um, I don't want to be weighed down by relationship. You're, you're changing. And that's what your intention is for a lot of you. Is to bring about a change. Um, a lot of you are wanting to come out of being by yourself. Maybe you're getting older, you're feeling like, you know, it's time. Okay, um, we have Scorpio energy here. We have air, <clears throat> um, Pisces, Sagittarius energy, and of course, here you are. All right, so Virgos, that's what I have for you guys for the 21st to the 27th. I'll speak with you soon.